All right, we only got a few minutes left. Let's knock these last two out. Let's go with Avi next. Right, so NASA, <laughs> as we all know, has a space station. And apparently they're going to have a few flights going up with a number of astronauts. So NASA has decided to uh, put a new uh, space toilet into the uh, space station to accommodate the volume that has to be uh, processed, if you will. So my question to the group is, if you knew someone who worked for NASA, how would you, how nicely would you ask them about is this money really worthwhile to spend? I mean, how? I mean, twenty three million is what it costs to make. What about all the amount of money used to, in terms of research, right? That could have gone for, I don't know, um, ballots, uh, election uh, <laughs> volunteers, training. I'm just asking a question, right? How, how would you ask those those employees a question, Robbie? <laughs> oh man. It's, I, but I'm all for it. And really, you, you forgot some important stuff, Avi. The toilet was a redesign, and a big part of the redesign was to help accommodate a better fit for female astronauts who traditionally are more svelte than their male counterparts. And if you're in space, <laughs> it's weightless. There's nothing holding anything back. So you got to make sure that this toilet is designed for everybody. My concern is, is there, I guess, does the seat, even, is there a seat? Is that even an option when you're in space? So there's I'm, one, I'm, I'm a wondering if there's right? I don't think you need a seat, because you can just, you float, you're weightless. So there's no argument. There's no about gravity. The seat in space. That's amazing. <laughs> All genders are equal in space. You don't fight about the toilet seat. <laughs> the Z. So, Avi, I'm sorry. Neo, do you still work for NASA? I can neither confirm nor deny deny that. So hypothetically, if my panel, if my co-hosts were NASA employees, I would ask them, okay, so do you guys shit gold? Do you shit uh, uh, that is definitely not a quote. <laughs> Why do you need a $23 million toilet? And you see how they try to, as men are wont to do, they try to blame it on the women in the scenario. Oh, he says, we're trying to make this, you know, accommodate women because they use the bathroom more and they are ergonomically different from, you know, men. So we have to pay $23 million. Are you kidding me right now? I mean, the you thing you have to remember home. is they spent $23 million, but the innovations that nasa creates they make a lot of money off of that off of uh off of the innovation selling the technologies that they create so mm -hmm. they get they make their money back you, you, you'd be that's surprised not, that's it's not it's, who's, who's, I mean, that's not the point i mean you know airma because the big commerce topic of conversation this week was airma's birkin bags they make their money back however a birkin bag is still minimum forty thousand dollars <laughs> Like, come on. Uh, come there's on. no innovation in bag making that's worth $40,000. I would rather have a Birkin than a $23 million toilet. Let me tell you. Let me tell <laughs> you. But if we put you in space, you will change your tune when your droplets are floating around. I promise you. I mean, I'm going to space in the Twilight Zone, so Rod Serling has my back. <laughs> Rod Serling. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Gianni, get a couple of questions. Look at a couple of comments in real quick. Sure. Um, Von Perry said, talk about good money going down the toilet. Um, <laughs> we have that there, Von. We see what you Horrible dad there. joke. <laughs> Horrible dad joke. <laughs> dad joke. Yeah, that was a good pun. Horrible dad joke. <laughs> um, Kevin Daxon said, the compost technology will help our environment. Oh, see, there you go. See, yeah. mm -hmm. they're paid it's for itself. Like I said, it paid for itself. It's just going to it's gonna be expelled into space. There's no technology <laughs> there. The technology is when it comes out, how to compress it and then push it out. That's <laughs> the technology. I don't know who's going to buy that technology. <laughs> we told y'all in the 80s, the trickle down effect does not work. Hello. <laughs> All right. See you in a bit, Gianni. Hi, right, Lizzie. 